Now, if you ask me what is compassion, I don't think I can separate it from wisdom. You know, I think of the Tibetan Buddhists often putting together wisdom and compassion. So to have compassion, to know how to be in another person's moccasins mm. takes wisdom. Mm -hmm. I mean, it takes effort, I suppose, but it also mm -hmm. takes something that, you know, I'm certainly still aspiring to, you know, the, the capacity to, to feel in your heart nature's rhythms. Mm. That's actually where wisdom comes in for me because a wise person I don't think of as a storehouse of knowledge. That's a library, you know. I mean, uh, to some extent, wise people could store knowledge, but it's really the really wise person is the one that's vibrating and in tune with the unfolding energies of nature. 